Let's go. Aloha, everyone. Happy Thursday. Welcome to the Hawaii Spa Association High Spa Vendor Series. We are very excited that you've joined us today for our High Five Reasons for Partnership. And today, let me go around and introduce who's with us on the call. I am Amanda Schmiggy, our board secretary, and we have Sean Hallam and from uh, our president, of course, and Jennifer Holsworth, our vice president, Daryl Lehman, our treasurer, and we may have our advisory board on. I'm not sure if Cecilia and Sharon may be joining us as well. They are on our Hawaii Spa Association advisory board as well. But today we're very excited to be joined by Jay Mueller, who is our Vice President of Hospitality at Technogym. And he has been with Technogym for over 10 years, and he has the opportunity to go around uh, with top hotel resorts and iconic brands, world-class uh, country clubs, all sorts of destinations, and really creating partnerships and bringing new technologies from Technogym. Uh, and really, he, he lives and breathes uh, what he also goes around and helps um, partner with people, but he lives and breathes an active lifestyle and is able to really partner that with his clients all over the world. Uh, he actually is based in Long Island, New York, and I had the privilege, actually, a fun fact um, about Jay and myself is I had the privilege to meet him in person eight years ago, I think it was, in New York City when I was working for a luxury hotel there, and it was a very small spa, or it was a big spa, very small gym space, and he really uh, helped us collaborate uh, and really helped make that one um, enhanced and really bring it to life there and that's the last time i've actually seen jay in person um but our paths have crossed um, many times through the years and through uh working in this industry um so it's really fun to connect with him again um but yeah that's the last time i saw him in person years ago in new york but we are very honored that he he could be with us today um so while he um is based in New York. He lives there with his wife and uh, two daughters. He also does a lot of active things. I think he has some surfing represented behind him even on his board, um, but he does a lot of surfing. He coaches soccer, stand-up paddleboard, snowboarding, um, and of course he does a lot of training um, as well. But uh, while we've all been in quarantine and lockdown during this particular year, uh, he actually brought his love of pizza uh, to lunch and he bought his own pizza oven. And so uh, him and his family have been making um, pizzas, but inspiration because uh, through the years working with Technogym, he's had the opportunity to go to Italy many times. So he's making authentic Italian um, pizza and maybe with a with a New York style flair, um, I hope. So uh, again, we're very honored that Jay can be with us today and really walk us through some uh, opportunities that we have with Technogym, particularly at this time dealing with COVID uh, and definitely some strategies for reopening and keeping our gym safe. But uh, with that, I'll go ahead and hand it over to Jay to uh, lead us through this. Thank you so much, Jay. Thank you, Amanda. Thank you, the Hawaii Spa Association, the, the members of the board, the advisory council as well. I'm honored to be part of this, uh, this day today and, and presenting Technogym uh, on behalf of the organization. Uh, I'm looking at those pictures. I don't know where you grabbed those from, but it was, it brought a smile to my face just seeing, cause you did pull like a, a, tech, a, a New York City picture right around that time that we were meeting. Amazing. It probably might have even been the day we met. So really cool. Um, all right, I'm going to get into slideshow mode. As um, Amanda has stated, I've been with Techno Gym for uh, over 10 years, at, live in Long Island, New York, and, and lead the hospitality and, and uh, residential uh, line of business for, for our organization. So today we'll just touch base quickly. Um, I have 30 minutes, maybe a little bit less now, but to present about the company, I wanna talk about some wellness branding post COVID, right? We're in this situation, but how do we get through this? Uh, and some of the trends, consumer trends and consumer today and fitness is, you know, 
through the roof. It's like uh, you, you try to find a kettlebell or a dumbbell today, it's, it's near impossible. Uh, it's important to talk about the digital applications. We're seeing a lot of uh, the influencer space take advantage of the social media platform to deliver their content. Um, so we want to talk about what My Wellness 5.0 will do. Uh, for those that are involved in hospitality and the in-room side of business that was on the rise pre-COVID, it's still now even more important than ever due to the buzzwords of cleanliness, safety, et cetera. Um, I'll talk a little bit about the day in the life of a guest um, and what, or, or a journey. I, as, I, as I mentioned, I, I cover hospitality and residential, so that includes leisure clubs and country clubs and the residential towers that might be present throughout the, uh, the islands if you look at the west coast of Maui or Waikiki Beach, and it also provides some marketing solutions. So just quickly about TechnoGym, you know, just like Hawaii has a culture and steep in history, TechnoGym, a lot less time in, in, the, in the grand scheme of it, but for 37 years of, of business and developing fitness and wellness, our president and founder, Nerio Alessandri, um, we're, we're an Italian-based company up in the Northeast of Italy, um, and he had a vision, a passion for uh, design and um, innovation, and, and thought that, uh, that if things can be done in a better way from design and biomechanics, and you know, hence technology and gymnastics, Techno Gym was born in his garage. In 2012, we launched the new garage for the new era. This is our global headquarters in Cesena, Italy. Uh, we hosted the Global Wellness Summit uh, two years ago um, in Italy, and we had a number of uh, great leaders in spa and wellness throughout the world. The global community descended upon Techno Gym Village, where we do our manufacturing, where our, our global sales and marketing is, and perhaps the world's greatest gym is based right here in this, uh, this dome. Um, some high points, you know, 14 branches. We are truly a global company, 14 wholly owned branches, over 2000 employees, uh, over 70 distributors. There really isn't a place we cannot sell or service uh, throughout this world. And when I think of Hawaii specifically, uh, we have a number of great references in the wellness community. Uh, Jennifer on the board here at Montage Kapalua, TechnoGem representative. Um, and at the same time, we've got a great level of, of service now with, I think it's four service providers throughout the islands today to help serve you. Um, we have been the official supplier to the last uh, seven Olympic Games. Um, we're supposed to be the eighth this year, actually going on, going on right now, and uh, or should have just concluded with, with Tokyo, but we'll hope for next year. Um, steeped in innovation, TechnoGym, you know, I, I'd like to say that for the past 10 years, we've had a new innovation every single year. And more importantly, I'd say for the past few quarters, even during COVID time and a time where we've seen a little bit of contraction in the market space, a lot of innovation every quarter this year, a new innovation coming from TechnoGym. Um, I talked about the Olympics and our, and our, uh, our partnership there, where by being a partner in these sports uh, organizations and these clubs just gives us unprecedented access to um, doctors, physiotherapists, the athletes themselves to deliver um, the world's best solutions for you and for your members, your guests, and or your residences. Uh, you see one here, uh, just in April, we, we launched, we're not standing still for you all, right? We're, we're continuing to push forward. I talked about innovation in terms of equipment, but even in our partnerships and think about Kona, what happens every fall. We got the, the Ironman uh, championship at, and uh, we are the exclusive official supplier to uh, Ironman now. So um, you'll be seeing more representation from us on the big island when uh, Ironman Kona comes back around. From a hospitality standpoint, you know, we, we have the market covered from everything from five-star luxury to the four stars and upper upscale and all the variety of chain scales. We have something for everybody, okay, uh, from cardio to strength to functional training solutions for every fitness facility to in-room exercise as well. Uh, I talked about residential. It's another leg of our business that we serve, and we work with some of the best um, design houses and even notable buildings, Fendi Casa, Porsche Design, Armani Casa. Uh, we, we are sailing on board or we had been sailing on board uh, cruise and hopefully we, that uh, 
a line of business comes back to life uh, pretty quickly. I, I saw a great article today, actually, MSC Cruises was talking about how um, most recently they, they've, they're back sailing in some ships and they're getting through it and, and no cases and everything was good. So, you know, the cruise industry is figuring it out. And then Leisure Clubs, uh, PGA Tour, matter of fact, up by Jennifer up in Kapalua, they kick off the tour every year there at the plantation course, um, plantation village. And we put an installed, it's a Troon facility, and we installed a Technogym Golf Performance Center uh, right there with a Kinesis, a Skill Run, and a couple of other skill products in a, uh, what was once a boardroom is now converted to a, uh, a golf performance center. So uh, we're, we're continuing to evolve and develop uh, solutions for you as we partner with these great organizations like the PGA and USTA. Um, our mission is helping people live a healthier lifestyle. I absolutely subscribe to this. I think that uh, wellness for all is, you know, regular routine, physical exercise, movement, whatever that may be that you can do daily, um, proper nutrition. And I'd say that that was probably the toughest element of my, as, as Amanda talked about pizza, uh, you know, it's the, it's the toughest element uh, to the wellness lifestyle. But once I man ma married the two, really, I gained uh, a tremendous, uh, I closed the cycle there, the, the, the pyramid, which was the right mental approach. So wellness today, pre-COVID, post-COVID means boosting immunity. We're only going to see this word pop up more and more throughout time. So we'll talk about a little bit of uh, branding and messaging uh, in post-COVID times. And wellness, as I said, has never been more important, okay? Um, what we're talking about seeing healthy spaces, um, you know, not only in hospitality, but health purpose built health, well built, we'll call it um, environments and that's both at home as I talked about the consumer businesses on fire today, and then also wellness community based act activities. Um, you know, and, and of course, the technology interlaid in that, right? We're seeing, you know, a lot of people are tracking their exercise, their, their activity, um, both outdoors and indoor spaces, um, you know, and also looking beyond the four walls. You have, I think one of the things that's amazing about the islands of Hawaii uh, allows you to really get outside those four walls. It's probably the biggest competition that training inside a space is, is because the weather is so nice and all the, the great gardens and trails and, and just all the scenery that you can walk and run around to, but you can still track your exercise and utilizing a hub like the Technogym My Wellness app. Um, and just allow us to continue to be a premium wellness partner for you. You know, our complete wellness on the go ecosystem puts your member, your guest, your resident at the very epicenter of their experience on property, in community, and then also when they're back home or whether they're living on island, right? Just how they can you know, leverage the technology to track their exercise at home, on the go, in the hotel, in their club, even at the doctor, tracking all their exercise and being able to go to the doctor and show their wellness app and show what they've done from a, a, an exercise and movement capacity will make your doctor visits more effective and efficient. Some consumer trends, you know, architecture is really about being well as well. So Zaha Hadid, you know, a famed and prized uh, architect and designer, you know, people want to feel good in spaces. I I've traveled the islands. I've seen some great, I've, I've, I've actually worked on a number of great projects. And what I love about them all is just the design that you're bringing into the spaces. You know, Daryl there at Hilton Hawaiian Village. Um, had done a renovation a few years ago and just open, airy, beautiful space. Um, the Grand Wailea has just recently refreshed and, and again brought some, some great design to the space. Of course, Montage Kapalua up there north of um, northwest of Maui, um, doing amazing with the design. Just that's what people want to train in. It's not just always about the best equipment, but it's also feeling good in the spaces we train in. And then again, I've mentioned before, the purpose built, the wealth built. Green buildings was tackling energy, but also now we have to treasure the most valuable re, you know, assets of these buildings, and that's the people that reside in them. We want people living a healthier life. And healthy amenities, you know, um, for those that are, you know, renting in these apartments in Waikiki Beach, uh, you're willing to spend a little bit more for the better amenities, right? So uh, as a developer, this is the type of thing that, that they want to hear. 
Um, maybe if you're a, uh, uh, a tenant, you don't want to be paying more. I can understand that too, but uh, uh, budgets are certainly a, a, a constraint for everybody's personal income. But the point is people are willing to spend a bit more for um, healthy amenities. Um, and as I talked about that wellness on the go, it's well, an integrated wellness approach. Our, our love affair with fitness in the past used to be episodic. It would be a one moment your day. You wake up in the morning and you train. You come home from work and you train. Uh, maybe you do something during the day that's considered exercise and, and train. But now it's integrated throughout our, our life, the various touch points that we deal with, um, whether we're in the office, whether we're at home, whether we're in the gym, we're constantly in and around wellness. So it's, it's TechnoGym is, is believes in this integrated wellness approach and we are ahead of the curve. You know, we're building the best solutions or touch base on the partnerships and the, the unprecedented access we have to, to, that gives us the permission to build these experiences, but really also completing the journey for you. So um, what does this mean for you? Again, I talked about the wellness on the go. Technogym is managing member lifestyle for over 25 years with our wellness system. We went cloud-based over 10 years ago with our Technogym My Wellness Cloud. That again, puts the end user at the very epicenter of the experience. And we want them and you to as an operator to connect with them all on all of these experiences. So we're offering you an ability through our Technogym My Wellness app to really develop um, an experience, a journey, if you will, right? So we hear about COVID, we hear about occupancy restrictions. Through Technogym My Wellness app, you can book classes, you can reserve your time. So if you have a 30, percent occupancy for a 30 space gym and you can fit nine people, you can put nine spaces available and you can have the facility manage the inflow outflow of the guests or members that are coming into the space. We're now offering clubs, a platform through our My Wellness 5.0 to curate content and put it on our My Wellness 5.0 app, live stream classes. You can connect with your worldwide network of members. We have an on-demand library through our master trainers and influencers. It's, it's really sleek. It's not just you know, button pushing, following along. It's, it's actually videos done in our content factory in Milan. And of course, the outdoor training and also allowing for remote coaching. Um, so this, again, is just allowing you as an operator, a platform to connect with your members virtually. This is so important for your business today. Um, as I said, we've seen the reshape of business in the, in the boutique fitness space. As Amanda said, I participate a lot in those right now because of COVID, can't really do it. So, um, you know, I'm following my favorite trainers today on, um, you know, on, on Instagram and social media. So why not have an opportunity to, to connect with them through an app? Even constraint-friendly wellness solutions, right? We can allow you to, to provide your guests, your members, your residents, access to what you're offering in terms of cardio and the amount of, of equipment free and available. So if you have five treadmills, you can see that five are free. If you like to, if you like to run and it happens to be a rainy day and you wanted to get on the treadmill, you can see how many are available. And if they're all occupied, well, you might check back in a, in a short period of time later to make sure that when you're going, that the uh, equipment is available for you. Talked about in-room. I mentioned that before, the in-room trend was on the rise prior to COVID. Now we're gonna see a lot more of that today because of the, the safety, the cleanliness, the, uh, the privacy. And, and we have Technogym case um, and just Technogym products or not, just think about the in-room solutions um, and how you can connect with the guests. And the case itself is premium leather case. It's got great tools for mobility, flexibility, uh, light resistance, smart case, QR code enables you to cast your, um, your personal trainer, your guided videos and instruction on the machine. So the, on, uh, sorry, on a TV or in the app, the, the Technogym web app, uh, providing an experience that you can do in room. We've got a new product uh, to, to look at, uh, born from the boutique fitness studio spaces, the Skill Bench, which is a uh, plastic mold bench with 
that houses dumbbells, hexagonal dumbbells from five to 20 pounds with some resistance bands. We will have a consumer-based app that's gonna provide guided workout. So again, these are things that you can think about as I talk about the Ironman, skill bike, performance cycling, cycling experience in tandem with a skill bench, really bringing the performance experience. It can be a, a sports-minded solution in a guest room or in a residence. Uh, for somebody to lease or rent from you a la carte or on demand. So the wellness ball active sitting. Sitting is the new smoking, right? The, the sedentary lifestyle, unfortunately, you know, for sure, uh, mainland Americans are spending about 14 hours a day. I can't say you know, from Hawaii, I, I would be remiss to think that it, with that gorgeous weather and all that, the waves and everything that's going on out there, I'm sure you're a little bit more active than we are. Um, but we here in mainland, 14 hours on average sitting in a day. And just so you know, um, I talked to uh, the board before this call, and, and I'm excited that we're going to have a, um, a, a raffle for a wellness ball active sitting uh, for a lucky uh, winner uh, to, to have one sent to, uh, to your home so that you can uh, actively sit as opposed to sitting on a, on a desk chair for the few hours that you may, because again, you're in Hawaii and you're running and riding and doing all the fun things in the outdoors. Um, we have a lot of little accessories from wellness racks. Uh, this is the wellness rack right here. These little disc weights, they connect together to go from like three pounds to 20 pounds of dumbbells. Uh, we put this in the Post Oak Hotel in Uptown in Houston, and they've got them in all 270 guest rooms. They put the Technogym case in in three rooms. So they've got a wellness offering in conjunction with the wellness rack, and they put in a, uh, a Technogym bike in the space as well. Amanda, how am I doing on time? Good. You good? You still have about uh, five to ten more minutes. Yes. Uh, all right. Cool. I don't see a clock here, so I'm just going. All right. Cool. Good. So uh, we talk about. Um, I mentioned before various touch points throughout the day. The integrated and episodic, you know, the wellness approach, right? Well, we believe and we want that you to be top of mind of the guests of the member experience. And that means tip of tongue, the word of mouth, the viral, virality, if you will, the viral aspect to which people can really take, uh, draw from their experiences and, and bring that forward and, and recognize where they had the best wellness experience. So, you know, it's important to think about the day in a life. And I'll, some of those solutions that I've already talked about, I'm gonna carry forward in an hourly approach here in a minute to a wellness aspect. But then, of course, also managing the wellness lifestyle through the, the wellness app. Um, it just, again, leads to that increased word of mouth advertising. So a day in a life. Let's just say at 7 a.m., right, somebody wakes up and Technogym has all my wellness 5.0 and you're an operator and you're delivering live streamed content. Or the, the, the member of a club is a Technogym subscribed club and they're delivering on-demand, Technogym on-demand content. Imagine 7 a.m wake up morning stretch do one of our yoga programs. What a great way to start the day to get out. Then, maybe that's not your thing, right? But, or, or maybe that was and you're just so into wellness, you're gonna do the yoga and you're gonna hit the trail. But you can go outdoors now using the Technogym by Wellness 5.0 app, track your exercise because it has GPS capability. It also connects to these great applications and great devices that you can link your accounts so that you can track all your various types of exercises, whether it's cycling or running or walking, uh, right there through the hub, which is the Technogym My Wellness app. So you can get indoors in the morning, wake up and energize uh, with a yoga class through content provided by the My Wellness 5.0. You can track your exercise. Now it's the end of the day, you know, an evening workout, train on Technogym equipment or, or train on fitness equipment. So it's important. Um, getting outdoors. Look, we even have outdoor equipment. You have got beautiful scenery, beautiful gardens, beautiful campuses of, of, of wellness and hospitality. And I talked about getting beyond the four walls of fitness. This is exactly what we're talking about, bringing equipment outdoors. This actually is uh, the Skyview Athletic Club in, in LA, um, downtown LA, um, that has outdoor equipment, uh, purpose-built, it's cataphoresis, so it's got all the uh, elements so it won't stain, it won't rust. Um, it actually is, you know, manages the weather elements. So if it's too hot, it's not going to burn your hands if you touch it. So amazing technology resides here. We can do all sorts of 
the hurricane ratings and proofing, working with your local governances to get those certifications so that you can install safely, securely, and meet all the requirements. We've had all that type of conversations. You know, it, it's it's gone so different when it comes to what you learn when you bring a new solution to the market. You never thought you're going to be doing hurricane ratings and certifications with governments, but here we are. Um, hey enjoy a nice cocktail in a lounge why why do we just have to have chairs you know or seats you can absolutely think about wellness in the lounge wellness in a bar um here we have you know somebody sipping on a, a cocktail a glass of wine it looks like and some beautiful breadsticks there um that uh you know eventually why not have a a wellness sit and relax closing your day maybe all that never happened Everything I just talked about, and now you're getting to the end of the day, and you get home, or you get into your residence, or you get into your hotel room. You say, you know what? I really did want to get into my wellness time, and here I have this Techno Gym case. I can do a pre-bed wind down, you know, uh, workout using the Techno Gym case, the yoga mat, a foam roller, some light resistance, just to end your day smoothly uh, and wellness oriented, uh, so that this, this way you can say that you checked that box. Okay, so you saw the wheel, right? The wellness on the go, but also the total wellness solution from an operator standpoint. You know, we, we help you as operators. Uh, we can do spatial planning. We have after sales and service and support through our, our service provider, trained service provider network throughout the islands. We talk about the apps, devices, and content. We have smart equipment today. That's the, the basis of the treadmills, the cardio, the uh, strength lines of equipment, all super connected smart equipment. We have programs in education. We are absolutely looking to build a master trainer network throughout the islands. So please, anybody, send me your, your top trainers. We wanna, we wanna find a way to connect and we want them to be master trainers for us. So this way we can educate them, promote the, the wellness message you know, on behalf of Technogym throughout the islands and help you deliver that message as well and connect to the community more. And then finally, marketing solutions, right? It's, this, uh, this is born from, you know, we have, I talk about the residential strategy launch, but this can be implemented for any one of the, the lines of business from hotels and resorts to country club. But this is really the why, right? Um, it's like, you have these great fitness facilities and it's about, educating your marketing and sales staff on how to you know sell the space it's about educating and highlighting for your members your residents your, your guests um, about what's unique in this space how to train more effectively if you're doing a refresh providing an amazing fitness map on an easel back that can be done that, that promotes what's coming soon right you want to promote you want them excited we can provide marketing tools um, that can go on the web, press releases as well, so that you can you know, go to market and, and just shout to the rooftops and to the rafters that like, hey, we are doing wellness and we care about you, the most important pe you know, asset in our, in our business, which is the people. So the residential playbook, or we'll just call it the playbook, it can be, it's a book, it's digital, it can be soft touch, it's handed to the member, the resident, the guest, or it's something, as I said, that's digital provides information about the equipment that's in the fitness facility, instructs you, guides you on how to download the My Wellness app, provides glorious images of the fitness facility that we're designing for you in 3D, and also highlights other, <clears throat> highlights other information on Technogym. Again, with also a facility map, so you can see the special zonings. How can you train more effectively in this space? Because we think about it, not just putting equipment in. We really want to tell a story. That's what I love about hospitality and residential. It's telling stories. And if we're not connecting with you meaningfully, then we're falling down. And we want to make sure that the spaces are laid out appropriately, that they've got the right story that you're trying to deliver to your, your guests. And then, of course, I talked about the marketing tools um, that, that we um, offer from anything from uh, quick screens to uh, social media, um, uh, we'll say posts that we can curate for you, imagery for your website, and then even content for the app should you be subscribing. And then lastly, the, uh, the press release. So that takes me through my presentation. Hopefully I've captured in an essence the five why uh, for here at High Spa.
Yes, thank you so much, Jay. I think it did uh, capture the, the five reasons for, for partnership and uh, the innovation is really, really always impressive with Technogym, but uh, some of the new things that you mentioned uh, today are very, very exciting. Um, and I have um, previous personal experience in some of my properties, um, especially using the app. The app is amazing, but I love to see even the, the further enhancements they've done with the app. And also I'm ready for that outside equipment. I love what they've done with the outside um, pieces and uh, weathering the weather, <laughs> which is, is really exciting. I'm, I'm ready to talk to you about that one on the side later. <laughs> so. Amazing. Um, but thank you so much, Jay. That was really great. I'm going to hand it over to Sharon, uh, who's going to lead some uh, questions that have come from uh, our participants today. And so go ahead, Sharon. Thank you so much. Aloha, Jay. Good to see you again. Aloha, Sharon. How are you? I am well, thank you. So, um, of course, the top of mind question of everyone is what ROI? opportunities are there or what is the best ways that you've seen to generate revenue with a uh, partnership with Technogym? Yeah, that's a, that's absolutely a great question. And I really think right now with the, if we think about it from the hotel and the hospitality side, this in-room wellness attaching, you know, training safely in a space, um, just to cite two examples, right? I mentioned the Post Oak Uptown who's doing wellness rooms, who's attaching, you know, an increased uh, rate to the, to the offering. Um, at the same time, the uh, the Boca Resort down in, in, in Waldorf Astoria and Boca Raton, they are, you know, they're just, sadly, we're all projecting a little bit down in terms of occupancy. So they took two rooms offline and they're basically building wellness pods. So they took all the equipment out and they put in a couple of pieces um, to generate, um, you know, a treadmill, a bike, a, 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 sk a skill bench, and then, you know, the Technogym case that they're selling to members because they have, they have 10,000 members there on that property. It's very, it might be very different than many of the properties we're talking about today here on the island. But, you know, you might have some properties with members and they're charging a, an hourly rate within a hospital style cleaning. Come back in, get another member in. And for guests, they're enhancing the, the rate for a little bit more um, dollars. So I've seen that in-room wellness component is absolutely um, a big part. And then for anybody that's talking about, um, you know, that's the hospitality side, but if we're thinking about the, the member club, the private club, that My Wellness 5.0, and being able to curate your own content for your member on island to connect to them meaningfully, you know, it's, it's about training. One, there, there's two things. One, we're extending the brand. Two, at the same time, you want to keep your membership safe. And if you have somebody that might not be feeling well or is presenting a fever and can't come in, but still is still relatively feeling well, but we're trying to keep the community safe, well, you can connect to them at home. So the, 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 the technology for my wellness is, is going to provide a, a, an opportunity for through revenue to be able to sell um, subscription there. Amazing. Thank you. Yeah, I, I love uh, Vanessa and all she does at the Boca. So I'm, I'm thrilled to see that they're doing a lot. I wonder, yeah. um, curiosity wise, would Technogym do drop shipping to their membership if they wanted to sell retail and have kind of that partnership aspect as an ROI as well? Is that something uh, you guys have delved into? Yeah, and, and thank you, actually. I, I, you know, this is being recorded and hopefully no one from Techno Gym is watching because the, uh, the home revolution, I, I mentioned the, the surge of at-home wellness component, right? Um, and just um, what we're promoting for our most prestigious partners, and I say prestigious partners, people that have gone like basically wall to wall with Techno Gym. It's an exclusive club to be part of Techno Gym. And um, we are, we're tapping into that and we would like to develop a win-win relationship, a trading partner agreement where we will offer a, um, a special incentive for the guest, for the resident, for the member to purchase equipment that can be sent. They ba we basically assign a code to the, um, to the club or to the, to the hotel. And they in turn, because once we have this agreement in place, um, 
we can ship it anywhere in, in the, the country, in, including Hawaii, um, to them. And we recognize a, um, you know, a, something back to the property as well. So there's definitely an ROI. You know, I always push you, Jay, so. <laughs> of course, of course. <laughs> Thank you for that. Um, so Yoshimi had a question of what the best selling products of Techno Gym are and um, what the new trend for the gyms um, might be. That's a great question. And for, um, you know, a fitness equipment manufacturer, the number one selling pieces are going to be absolutely treadmills. Number one treadmill, uh, not too far behind ellipticals. Okay. And I'm happy to say, um, you know, I try to keep the presentation to kind of guide you all down a path, a journey, if you will. But for anybody that wants to catch up after this, uh, at some point in the weeks to come, we've just launched new excite live. Um, which is our flagship product. The islands like Jennifer and, and the grandma, they've got ultra luxury product that sits like way atop. So Jennifer, you're safe and sound with having the, the very best, don't panic. Um, but the, uh, the Excite Live is our flagship cardio line and um, it's going to be chock full of new content, which will also be updated and upgraded to the, uh, the artist line that our our friends in Kapalua have, have invested in. So um, yes, treadmills and ellipticals, number, number one and two. Excellent, thank you. And I remember us speaking about the in-room options before they were ever out um, back in Maui. So mm -hmm. what now are the cost um, implications and any minimums there might be for- the Sure, great, great. So the Technogym case, $650, okay. So that's what we have for the, uh, the, the kit. That's that leather bag, uh, premium leather bag with all the tools. Uh, when you, uh, listen, when you eyeball it, you might say, hey, I can get that stuff on Amazon for a little bit cheaper than that. But I have seen um, throughout the industry over time that these types of programs have, have not had much success. And I find that the, the biggest thing that, that we're bringing to the table here is beautiful packaging. It's going to be, you know, descriptive with cleaning these instructions and help the operator um, home for every little piece of kit in the bag. But it's wrapped in digital. That QR code with the with the content is really what helps this story tell, right? It's not just bringing a kit. The 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 end user that that um, may or may not have used it or subscribed for it or went down to the front desk and ordered something in the past was perhaps it was really just the hyper-specific that wanted a yoga mat in their room. Now you can attract somebody that's going to do workout in the safety and the privacy of their room and actually be instructed to and in how to do it. So it's, it's a real value add. So that Technogym bike is our, our new live stream on demand content cycling experience. And that bike itself is uh, $2,900. Uh, 2980 to be exact, um, with a $60 a month subscription. This is live streaming content. It's on-demand content and a cycling experience. Um, we have two great content providers today, uh, One Rebel out of the UK. And just so you know, the One Rebel Club in, in London, the Hard Rock Hotels took a little bit of an inspiration from their, their, their lobby design for the, um, from the One Rebel but we are in the process of building out more content from a U.S. mainland um, content provider. It's, you know, if COVID didn't strike, we would we'd probably be further along down there, but uh, we're, we're, we're getting ready to do some things. So more content coming. Awesome. Thank you. So you answered the Peloton question. And um, the what? The, oh, I thought you were jumping into. So um, <laughs> no, I, I'm joking. I'll just say the who, the what? <laughs> We don't say the P word around here. All right, the, the second best. Um, so what is the lifespan of equipment and are there recycling programs? So lifespan for cardio, you know, can, can go about seven years easily, you know, depending upon usage. I tend to see brands, hotel brands, depends. Sometimes they say three years, sometimes they five, say five years. We all know the story. Owners don't want to spend, you know, and flip equipment every three years. And it's a tough enough job to do it every five years. So seven years. But what ends up happening is technology really catches up to that cardio line. It's really like the iPhone of, of things today. 
Um, we've done a really good job though. Like as I'm, I'm talking now about this new line of Excite Cardio that's gonna have this new live platform on it. And anything that's been installed from 2016 will be upgraded automatically software wise with a new platform. So working with Technogym, we really value the partnership. We, we're always innovating and we're trying to bring, you know, protect your investment. We recognize that. Um, and by working with like an Android pr platform, that's enabled us to really, um, to tap into the, the type of mechanisms that smartphones and devices like that use. Um, and recycling program, um, no, it's it's uh, it's a bit tougher here, especially when it comes to on island. Um, you know, we work with uh, mainland based um, third party buyers and there's a, a significant expense to getting equipment from island to the back to mainland to sell it to which they usually remarket it to other you know parts of the world. So one of the best things to do really is find local municipalities and we've got great, um, you know, uh, our, our, our heroes in the armed forces. Um, we have the, um, the police and fire departments um, and, and any other entity that might be looking for a donation of equipment that could help even with the tax write-off. It's perhaps the best way. I know it doesn't help you in your pocket as much, but it's just a different beast out there. And, and I will say it's even difficult here on mainland because the market is chock full of used equipment and it's only market dependent. And if they're full of equipment, the rates just go further down. So it's tough. Yeah. Thank you for that. I was going to ask about kind of social and community options. So that's a great, great idea. Uh, so to that Excite and online platform, can you go into a little bit more depth on for the fitness trainer? being able to do live streaming classes to memberships? Sure. So um, we have My Wellness 5.0, and basically this is a, um, a you know, it's, it's our My Wellness app, but we've enhanced it. And we have a, uh, a user license model subscription, you know, per user. This enables the club to develop content, record content, and cast it live through our app. So basically, you know, they're recording with the camera, through the and, and using the My Wellness app to, as a platform to connect out to their member base. So you're I'll just I'm saying, hey, look, Montage Kapalua, let's just say there's the trainer in, in Kapalua and they're um, they're spitting out content to the to the member base. They can record it and they can put it out live at that very moment. And so that any member would have know their class schedule. They can register for the class. And they can they can watch the uh, that live streamed class and there's there's an ability for for Jennifer and the team to be able to um, have a, uh, a subscription by member. Amazing. Would they also be able to do um, individual exercises after, like for a personal trainer? Um, meaning like just like one-to-one -one instruction is it like so these are the exercises I'd like you to do until our next class yeah so we we have a whole suite of professional applications and one called prescribe and coach one prescribe and another one coach so two of the applications that enables you to, to curate workouts and and hold you know your your member your client accountable so the live streaming classes are really more the tapping into what's happening in social media today, right? And the, the, the live classes, Instagram live, um, whereas the professional applications of coach and prescribe, you're prescribing workouts based off of their needs and you're coaching them through and able to connect with them wherever they may be in the world. Perfect. Thank you, Jay. So we are at time. Um, is there a last one sentence that you'd like to remind us or share? And then um, Jen will close us out. I just want to say thank you to everybody that's, uh, that's attended today. Uh, I want to thank again all of the board of the High Spa organization, our advisory council. Uh, great questions. I appreciate the, in, the engagement and enthusiasm. I look forward to supporting you all in the community, in your wellness, and you know you can count on Techno Gym to to continue to support.
Thank you, Jay. And actually, it's Amanda that's going to close us out. And um, thank you again for the amazing uh, gift giveaway as well. You're welcome. Thank you, everybody. Yes, thank you, Jay. And I was going to say thank you again. The, the Wellness Active Ball gift, gift giveaway will be amazing for one of our lucky winners for uh, participating today. So thank you for that. This was really, really great information. Uh, we love you. We love Techno Gym. So thank you so much. And uh, with that, I'm going to uh, hand it over to Daryl, who will tell us what to look forward to next week. Well, thank you, Amanda. And Jay, uh, what an inspiring uh, talk. I am sitting there and I feel that I just want to get up and just go out and work out. Um, you know, when I saw that uh, how your company had progressed from the garage to that ultra modern dome that you showed, you know, I, was, uh, I think it was Sean that mentioned that when you think of design, he comes to mind. So it's, you know, it's really, uh, it was inspiring to see. Um, I come from my background there as well because I got into the fitness industry through fitness, uh, into the spa industry through fitness. Um, I began as a fitness instructor uh, in the Jane Fonda era before Step was even invented. <laughs> it's an idea about my age, but uh, it was really it's amazing to see how the industry and particularly the techno gym has advanced the industry so much. And particularly also, I saw a little bit of my background in your cruise line uh, companies where you mm -hmm. uh, reflected Silver Sea and the Norwegian, both of whom I used to work on. And so I so, so enjoyed your presentation. Very, very inspiring. And thank you for that. Thank you, Daryl. Um, you know, in keeping with the, uh, I just would like to remind everybody, of course, that uh, we recorded the session. It's going to be listed on the, uh, uh, on our Hawaii Spa Association website. That's simply www.hawaiispaassociation.com. And uh, today we'll join the lucky other speakers that we've uh, uh, posted uh, for all our talks of the morning. And uh, in keeping with the Italian thing, next week, uh, our next speaker is Teresa Overholt from Comfort Zone. So uh, look forward to that. And um, same time, same place, 11 o'clock um, on this channel. And uh, we look forward to catching up once again. So again, on behalf of the board, Sean, our presidents and everybody else, and thank you to everybody who joined. And Jay, thank you for a wonderful presentation. Aloha, everybody. Aloha. Aloha, everyone.